Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil The Village. I have been chomping at the bit to get back at this game. So, let's go. We have a village to purge. I haven't seen any monsters and demons just yet, but... Uh, what happened? Hmm, goat heads. Unfortunately, <laughs> the game did not resume where I left off, but hey, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so we had quite a good discussion last night, uh, me and um, Jimmy Fails, about some thoughts about what's going on with the story. Oh, now we're getting into some meat and potatoes of what's going on. Locked due to missing homeowner. Oh dear. Do I have film grain on? Do I really have film grain on? Nope. Uh... Please say I do not have film grain on. Uh, display. Kind of looks like it. Film noise is off. Okay, fine. Look, kind of grainy. And lens distortion. Oh, hell no. That's one thing I must admit I did not like about playing these games on the consoles. <laughs> Um, the film grain and the uh, lens distortion effect that they put on. It's like, uh, no thanks. You make these beautiful games. And then you smear the shit out of it with all these post effects. No thanks. Right, what have we got here? So I'm guessing we need something. It's locked. Hey, we got chickens. Dude, can we get eggs from there? Do we get like rotten eggs and golden eggs maybe? My god, it's dark in here. We need a knife or something. To oh. We need a knife or something. Ask and you shall receive, my friend. Thank you. It's just a kitchen knife. But it'll do. First aid med. Can we? <gasps> Yes, we can organize the inventory. Oh my god, yes, yes. Oh, I like it. Spaces to rotate. Oh my good god. Right, we'll have our health meds and all that over in this corner. How do we... There we go. Oh my fucking god, I like that. Resident Evil 4 vibes. Mm, I'm getting the vapors. Okay, let's go. Look at this fucking place. Ooh. Did they just run out of a house? It certainly looks that way, Ethan. Damn. Well, they like their OJ around here. So I have been informed by um, Jimmy Fells that we're in Romania, apparently, which um, is nice to know because I had no idea. All right. Oh. No, Whoa. No, friendly. Friendly. Whoa. Who, Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road. And... What's going on? Look at his face. Oh, no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Oh. Take it. Take it. You're a lad. All right, now we're strapped. Hey, are you listening? Hey. Uh. Well, we just got a man killed. Oh, we've got a torch at least. Dead body? Yeah, looks like there's a few of them, Ethan. Wait, there's more. Yes. Oh, dude. 
So, he's given us a gun with 20 rounds. Need some more sensitivity. There we go. Oh, man. Jesus. Looks like we've gone back in time with these people. Like the 1800s or something. Jesus Christ. Yeah, he ain't here, man. <clears throat> I think we need to... What is wrong with this place? We need some fucking space marines. <laughs> oh, that one looks fresh. And oh, they all look kind of fresh. Oh, hey, friend. Jesus Christ. Ah. Yeah, I'm going to be needing those fingers, my dude. Jesus. I don't know, but I like it. I remember the gun we've got, Ethan. Come on, big boy. Oh, you quick. You quick. Get off me. Get off me. So, we can use space. Jesus. Got to get... Are we going for headshots? Fuck. Fucking hell. Yeah, I'm guessing we're going for headshots. Shit, that's not good. Get off me. Damn, we need a heavy bolter. Oh, God. Come on, you ugly motherfucker. So, are these like the basic enemies? Ooh. Right, so we've got block. Kind of need to use that a bit, I think. Uh, Ethan, you're missing a good portion of your hand there, my friend. Are we good with that? All right, so we've got quick turn, block. Apparently we've got two buttons for block, okay. Uh, God. Now, Ethan, see all of these shotgun shells that he spread all over the, the table here? Uh, now, now, I'm just saying, wouldn't it make sense if we could pick those up? <laughs> the bolt cutters. Yes, yes, the bolt cutters that were introduced in Resident Evil um, uh, 7 and we've used in Resident Evil 2 Remake and Resident Evil 3 Remake. I think we used them in Resident Evil 2 Remake, didn't we? Okay. Right. Oh, that's, that's feeling a little bit better. We need to get patched up because, you know, infections and stuff. Yeah, definitely going to want a herb, that's for sure. Right, what else we got going on? Chem fluid. Alright. Craft first aid meds. So... So a herb and chem fluid makes a first aid kit. Okay. Uh, Gunpowder and rusted scrap makes handgun ammo. Cool. Right, well, I don't want to worry about that too much yet. Uh, okay, well, I'm hoping that healing stuff is going to, you know. Oh, bolt cutters. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm picking up what you're putting down, game. Have we got anything else here? I mean, the fact that they have plastic bins. It makes me think they at least had some bin men or something. Oh, we do have feet. Uh, leads me to think that at least we are getting um, bin men coming around. So there is some public services. Picture of Mia and Rose. Well, we don't want that.
game just looks incredible. Alright. Somebody's scooting a body over there. Do you need help, sir? Do you need help moving that body? I'll do it. I'll give you a hand if there's some ammo in it for me. Can we go this way? We can. Alright. We're going to want to explore everywhere because... Do we have a map? We do. Oh my god, look at that map. Okay, we don't know how we move the map around. Can zoom in and out. Oh, right, okay. I guess we can't move it around because... It says to move it around by moving the mouse, but that's not happening. All right, fine. I like the map. The map's good. It's detailed. Okay. I would like uh, a flashlight or something. Which I'm guessing we do have, but we just can't use it. Like, when, when we want. It's a bit strange as well not to have the jump. But huge Resident Evil 4 vibes. Um, I'm actually, you know, this game's kind of making me... Oh my god. This game's making me excited for the Resident Evil 4 remake, if they do it well. I've got a radio that's not up to much. Bullets. Yes. Nice little magazine swap there. We've got some bodily juices dripping in through the roof. Something's up here, Chief. Yeah, there's something in here. Oh, shit. So how big is this village, then? More handgun bullets. Oh. You right there, Chief? Some chem fluid. Thanks, man. Cheers, pal. Yeah, we need to purge this city. This village. Ooh. There's, um... There's clearly an infest... Ooh. An infestation here. You can barricade. Oh, this is very Resident Evil 4. Hold. Yes. Oh, sweet fucking Jesus. Oh, Jesus, they're everywhere. Alright, well... We've oh, God, hello. Got a few more bullets. Nothing great. Oh, get off me, you dickhead. Come on. Enough of that. I don't want to play rough with you. So these guys are the lichens, then. So we haven't met the vampires. So you can... Oh, Crystal Skull. The fuck is this? Indiana Jones? It's a treasure. Oh, they got treasures back. The fuck are you looking at? Over. Come get some. Oh. So the radio seems to cut out like when those things are around. If there are any survivors out there, come Maybe to not. To Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? Near the fields? Well, that could be anywhere. Do we want to leave this barricaded? Let's have a little look. Oh, Jesus, yeah. Um, so we only had to shoot one of the furries in the head. All right. So I'm guessing we can't just, like, smash that through. Unless these uh, furries made... Oh my god, look at that f 
freaking hand. I was going to say, don't be a wuss. Definitely smash that open. I can hear grumbling. Oh man. I guess they can smell fresh meat. Unfortunately. Oh. Oh my god. They're everywhere. And I'm the meat. Jesus. We only have so many bullets here. Okay, I'm going to go out on a limb and say these things are fucking cool. Is he following me? Like stalking me? That's the way we've probably got to go. But I want to go look at the mill. I want to see what's down there. Oh, you gribbly motherfuckers. Unlock. Nice. You know what would help us out? quite drastically here a shotgun oh they're stalking you're the big guy aren't you you're the big guy uh, it's telling me to run you know considering the amount of them that are actually here probably not a bad shout yeah we're running we're running <laughs> Fuck this. Uh, we know. Oh. Okay. Wow, they're just, just giving us everything straight off the bat. How many have we got? Two shells. We got. Can I. Yes, I can. Oh. Come on. So they don't seem to necessarily charge at you. Gunpowder, nice. More bullets. Dude, if you come through here, I'm going to send your ass back out with this shotgun. Oh, there's so much I want to look at. Right. Can't shut that door. Huh? Attack flower to create. Okay. Oh, hey, friend. Oh. Well, that's all she wrote for those. Oh, okay. How many of these can we take out? Oh, God. Not like this, dude. Oh, he's down. More mo Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck. Ouch. We're out, we're out, we're out. We've taken a few of them. Oh, okay. Live to fight another day. Jesus, I'm wondering if you can actually hold out against those guys. I'm gonna say maybe. There's these flower sacks here. Not really sure that does. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, is this a dead end? What, 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 what's going on now? Big, angry, Rory boy. Oh, hey, friend. Uh. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Right, where are we going? Uh, I guess we're going, ooh. That's what we want. That's what we want. That's what we want. Right, that kills them pretty much straight away. Well, this gentleman seems to be a little on the little on the slow side, which is nice. Oh, there's just so many. Okay, let's have a little look inside here. Now, I get the fact that we're meant to be running away. 
but I'm not sure where we're meant to be running to. When that big lad comes through, we're gonna let him have it with a barrel. If that big lad comes through. Which I'm guessing he will. Come on, big lad. Ooh. Could he get through here? I don't know. Probably would be the answer. I guess he can get through here. Right, let's get up the stairs, see what we can find. Oh my god. Oh god, they got bows and arrows. Right, let's get some... Oh, they got weapons too. Yeah. That's not fantastic. Right, you're done, son. What is that? Um. Oh, right. I guess that's supposed to happen. There's a lot of furries here. Who the hell is that? King Furry, I guess. Oh, Jesus. The infestation is worse than I thought. Oh, jeez. Probably don't... Oh my god, look at that. Yeah, we, we need some assistance. Or not. Jesus. Oh, hello. I guess she's something to do with this? Was it her that kind of kicked everyone out? Not liking this. <laughs> um, oh, but I am, Capcom. I am liking this very much. So. Let's have a little look around. Now that we don't have the, the furry brigade breathing down our necks. We need some garlic or something. That's what we need. Okay. Okay. Ah, nice. I was going to say, there's got to be boxes and equipment and stuff that we've left behind. Uh, examine. Uh, well, we can't really open that with a family photo, I'm guessing. Um, do we not have any health? Yeah, our inventory starting to look a little bit on the small side. Semi-automatic pistol. Oh, look, we got power, rate of fire, reload speed, ammo. Oh, Jesus, yes. Yes. And the same with that as well. I mean, the rate of fire is like it can be upgraded. Pump-action shotgun, commonly used for hunting. Well known for its stability and reliability. Yeah, although, unfortunately, only seems to hold two shells. Okay. I'm surprised, um, to be honest. They're just giving us all this gear off straight off the bat. That's impressive. Right, I'm guessing we don't need to worry about uh, enemies now. So let's just have. Oh, hello. Oh, that's where we came through, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so um, my buddy Jimmy was saying, um, or Jimmy Fails was saying, uh, 
that you need to be really vigilant because when you kill enemies or when enemies die it's very hard to see the pickups and uh, I'm seeing what they were saying now because unlike in RE5 and 4 where you had the big glowy symbols you don't get that in this because obviously this is a, a grittier more realistic game um, I mean Resident Evil 4 is kind of gritty Oh, well, <laughs> I mean, it was great for the time, I suppose. But um, the game has has kind of aged as video game development has improved. Right, so let's go check out the wheel. And that lady went up through here somewhere. Let's have a little look. I get the feeling this is going to be a Resident Evil game that I play a lot. Um, just because... Of, hello, lady. You're a little cute, aren't you? In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? I'll take a look at hey, her. I don't think she cares. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? There it is, the church bell. Oh, look at that. The castle bell heralds danger. They're coming. <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again. <laughs> and now you're going to lock me in here with them. Rose Thanks. Yeah, apparently so. Look for Rose. So they're coming ag again. I mean, I think it's fair to say that we bloodied their nose the first oh look at this we bloodied their nose the first time oh currently searching so I guess that's like Resident Evil um, remake where if a room oh right so if somewhere's completely um, mined out it's it, it's kind of like that uh, blue sort of color Kind of like a teal color whereas if we're currently searching something it's still red so that's interesting i mean i guess on a game of this scope where apparently it feels a lot more open we can oh man look at this shit i'm taking like screenshots every 30 seconds God, this is what I've wanted in a res oh, an easy to pick lock. So we need lock pick. I see. I get ya. All right. Oh, oh, great lichens, the fabled monster wolves of old. May they come to eat our flesh. May they come to tear us apart. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, I mean, better you than me. But sure, I don't kink shame. lots of garlic everywhere I guess these garlic uh, uh, bundles everywhere aren't exactly keeping these lichens uh, at bay hmm. werewolves and witches in Resident Evil now if you told me that um, you know a few uh, few months ago or a few years ago I would have said, piss off, I don't want vampires and werewolves in Resident Evil. But, here we are. And it's good. And, you know, I've only played like the first, I don't know, what's this? Like, 50 minutes or so, I guess. And it kicks the shit out of Resident Evil 7. I mean, that game was... 
it was okay. Like I, I know people have their issues with it. I enjoyed it for what it was. It was a really fun game. It, it didn't. It wasn't. You know, it wasn't super Resident Evil. I guess the Baker's Mansion and all that was fun. But it just felt quite flat and linear compared to this. This feels open and ripe with exploration, which is a direction that I would like to see Resident Evil continue. It's, ooh, more scrap. Especially after, uh, you know, what Resident Evil 4... Um, which actually, yes, that was a linear game. Yes, it was. But it felt open and it felt ripe for exploration. You know? And it did have its secrets in it. Okay, I guess we still can't go through there. So, what's this lad all about? They like their goats around here. Let's have a quick weapons check. We all loaded. We are. C oh! Hunter. And there we go, it drops money, just like Resident Evil 4. I like it. I don't know how much 400 Lee is. I'm guessing it's not much. Nice. Certainly take your herbs. Talking of taking herbs, uh, I guess we can make some make right so okay we're missing the chem fluid right got you um, I want to make bullets <laughs> bullets for now castle, to the castle. Uh, that's Lady D's castle now she's a, uh, a vampire right so, is there two factions? Do we have vampires and werewolves battling it out? That would be cool. So, we've got this building here that we haven't plundered. See a box over there that we can loot. Looks like we need two imprintings here. So, this looks like this is like the demo area. Now, as I said, I did play this demo area. And I did complete it, so I kind of, unless they've changed something, I know what we've got to do here. We've got to find two things to go in there. Okay. Now on the demo, you don't really, ooh, you don't really have many bullets. Look at this. Ooh. Use typewriters to save your progress. We will do. So that's the Maiden Crest. Okay. So church. Should disaster fall upon the village, seek out the crests. One is in the care of the um, church. The other is in Loser's house. Okay. All right, well, we'll go see her. So before we do anything else, guys, I think we're going to give it a save. Uh, and I'm going to put a pause in this video. Or this might be the end of the video, depending on how long we've been recording for. So I guess for now, we're just going to keep going. Yeah, actually, I'm going to break this video off. I'm going to have to set up a timer using Shadow Play, I think. Right, okay, might be a short video, guys, but I'm going to end it here. Uh, when we return, we're going to go look for these crests and see if we can kick some more vampires. Oh, they're not vampires. Kick some more furries in the balls. So, till then, guys, thanks for watching.